here's a short video on how to export an animation as a video file from Blender. Um, so what I have here is a very simple scene where um, it's a US map uh, rotating. That's it. Um, so first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, let's just do, I wanna render the first 60 frames. So I'm just gonna put this to 60 here. Um, and then I'm gonna go down to the bottom right. There's a save icon here. It's the scene icon. Okay, so the scene icon. Um, frame rate 24. All right, so let's go and in the output, let's select a um, folder for you to save the file in. And then file format, let's make it a MPEG video here. And yeah, let's just keep it that way. Frame one to 60, it looks right. And I'm just going to play for you what it should look like. So, um, oh, sorry. One more thing is the color I have here is red. That's the actual surface. Um, I just happen to have a different color for the report. Um, but yeah, it should be something like this when it's rendered. Okay. So um, one more thing I want to look at is I'm going to look at the render engine. So I'm just going to try EV for now. Um, there's pros and cons for the different rendering engines. I won't go into that. Uh, in this video. So I'm going to go to render. Um, oh, one more thing I'm going to show you. I have a M1. So I have these options checked. Um, I don't think they always help. It really depends on what render engine we use. Um, so yeah, let's click here, render animation. And yeah, let's, this sh should take around 30, 40 seconds. All right, the first 60 frames is done. That took 35 seconds. I'm just gonna play it. And there we go, that's the animation. So I'm gonna try it again. Yep. All right, let's 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 just try out a few other ones. So um, I'm gonna look at uh, cycles and I'm gonna click GPU compute. And let's see how long that takes. Uh, I've sped this part up, but it ended up taking 15 minutes to render this video on cycles. Let's take a look at the rendered video. Okay, there we go. 